when the truth of the matter is the beautiful mind, the beautiful inner state, is when it is free, the energies are free enough inside to rise up and feed you naturally. So the question becomes, how does one go about doing that? And also, is everybody capable of that? A lot of times people sit there and say to me, oh yeah, well, you're higher or you're this or you're that. That's ridiculous. My experience from going through the growth I've gone through, and I've only been doing this for 40 years, every second of my life, all right, is everybody inside is beautiful. Everybody. I did 30 years of prison work, maximum security in there for you don't want to hear about. Beautiful, beautiful people. They write me to this day. I have relations or contact with a lot of them. The problem is the mind causes us so much disturbance. It creates so much anxiety. It creates so much worry and so on that we can't enjoy our lives. And so we end up doing things to try and get environments better outside to create a nicer environment inside, and it causes all kinds of trouble, lots of trouble. Look at the world around you. The entire problem of the world around you is caused because people are not okay inside. If people were fed inside, feeling whole inside, you would not have one fraction of the problems outside. You'd have much more harmony, much more togetherness. So this rising up of the energy, which happens by letting go of the neurotic mind, by letting go of the persistently talking and troublesome voice inside your head. There are ways to do that. There are, it's a lot easier than what people think it is. A lot of people sit there and say, well, I can't do that. Yes, you can, but you have to learn to do it. So what I